So I'm going to build a 4 seed deck, I think, based on uh, Caleb's deck. Cool. Thanks for the kind words. Oh, whoops. Horsey, horsey hamster. I'm planning on recording a bunch, like, I, I plan on recording them, like, at least a few a week if I get enough, like, screenshots or things to, like, actually think about. If I don't get enough, then, like, obviously I'm not going to, but I do think, like, there is a dearth of uh, easily digestible, like, mini lessons. Have link for Caleb list? I do, yes. I looked for it earlier. Or were you asking for it? today 22nd uh doesn't the layout say it insight makes are the easy ones Okay, we're there's no black. What's up, Hog Pog? Hope you're having a good day. It's actually funny, uh, Hog Pog. I went back and watched your matches. Uh, with the amulet shift deck, especially since uh, Stefan's a good friend of mine, and I wanted to see like how the matches played out. Versus him. Obviously, like, it was kind of interesting how insane Urza Saga was versus him. I haven't played a lot of... I haven't played Amulet seriously in probably, like, years. Get through both of your matches. Fair. You also were playing a lot of matches. Oh, Caleb has three ponder. This thing. I'm not gonna touch it until it's proven wrong. But it's something to look at. Brainstorm, Power Blast. So, I have, uh, I have a lot of respect for Caleb. Like, what a lot of people don't know about Caleb is he's played Legacy for basically forever. He's played Legacy since longer than I have. Uh, there's only one Sanctuary. I think the first Sanctuary is really the best one, almost period. So that is something to think about. Like, the first Sanctuary is definitely the first one, because, like, or definitely the best one, period. Is it true that Minx Files is to A and T? I think that's, like, generally true, yes. I think, like, generally you're going to lose just, like, 
storm storm combo like not the all-in storm maybe but like any deck that has like duress or pass in flames or veil of summer it's going to be not a fun experience for you if your opponent's competent so for for those of you who don't know i think caleb invented the vengevine the survival vengevine deck in legacy really and it was playing some really not good cards but it was also playing uh, Vengevine and Survival of the Fittest, so... Like, Survival of the Fittest is a really, really, really good magic card when you're discarding Vengevines to it. That is what I will say. I think Aqua Amoeba was one of the better cards in that deck, but that's also... It's also been years since I've played that deck as well. Like, literal years. Killup is part of the reason, yeah. But the Necrotic Ooze survival deck was also just, like, kind of busted. People kind of, like, figured out that you could actually, like, splice, like, Lion's Eye Diamond and, like, Enlightened Tutor into the deck, and it became, like, kind of... It just became really, 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 uh... Weaponized is, I think, the best word to describe it. Well, I've played Caleb quite a few times, RRL. Great guy. Caleb once told me all I had to do to become as big of a streamer as him was just stream 365 days in a year for 8 hours a day. And then when he said that, I'm just like, alright, I'm not going to do this. <laughs> um... Yeah, I don't know. I, I like Caleb a lot. Like, but the idea of just like streaming 365 days in a row for eight hours a day is like, well, first off, I think it's like just basically not doable unless if I literally didn't do anything besides stream and work. Because I have like a eight hour... Mostly work from home desk job is how I would put it. So, I'm not like particularly excited to like do something like that with my current setup. Caleb was super friendly back when he was beating you en route to winning PTQs. That yeah, sounds about right. I don't know. Oh, we're playing five blasts. That's a blast. Blasts are kind of sick, though. Like, I think it's kind of hard to understate how good the blasts are on rate. Because they just don't exist in other formats, you know? I don't think I want to play the fourth ending in the sideboard. I think I want to play something else, but I have to look at what else I want to play in that spot instead. Is it making sense to play... Let's see, what else could I play? I could play... Is Supreme Verdict castable in this deck? I guess, like, theoretically it's castable. Has anyone had good experience with Supreme Verdict recently in Legacy? I don't know. It just strikes me as like using a slot on sideboard on sideboarding one prismatic ending does not seem like the best use of a slot. Like just on my intuition. I could obviously be wrong, you know. Alright, I could play Seven's Reclamation. Meltdown. I could play Meltdown. Kind of do not hate the first Meltdown, honestly. I'm gonna check real quick though. Is there anything like is there any other deck 
Or is there any other card that I'm not thinking about? I bring it in a lot. Um, okay, uh, so I, I guess that is like sort of a valid point. I won't disagree with that. But I also, when I build these sideboards for me personally, I kind of just like having a more powerful card. Like, the, the Birds of Paradise thing is because Carpet is dead in the main deck sometimes, and so you're cutting Carpet for Birds to try to, like, even out the mana still. But here, I'm not sure that I need to do a similar sort of thing with Prismatic Ending. I mean, I could play it, but it also feels like I'm super, super, super soft to Graveyard Strategies, even with two Endurance. I don't think two Endurance generally beats most Graveyard decks, in my opinion. Is it crazy to sideboard a third Endurance instead? Let me see. Oh, wow. Caleb has another hamster deck. And it looks even... It looks kind of crazier actually I think I prefer third endurance what was this we have a hybridized we have moon stompy splashing minx is this good this one it seems like, <laughs> I don't know. This is a very weird deck to look at. We certainly have eight spirit guides and six soul ends. Uh, I just wanted to look at it, but I'm kind of not into this either. All right, I think I am actually going to play one meltdown. Because it seems like we're lacking coverage there as well. Well, maybe that's crazy. Play Applejacks. Uh, I don't have a lot of interest in that deck, but you're welcome to donate for a deck. Remember, people are welcome to donate for decks. I do accept those. Join the Discord, and there's a channel to talk about it. Because I don't want to, like, over or undercharge someone if I don't. You know, it's like kind of a sliding scale sort of thing. I'll just take my L's to Reanimator. That's okay. Am I playing the level up event? I will be. I'm playing with my buddy uh, Steve Nagy, and we're playing with small child Alex Rubin as well. He's our third. I mean, I guess if you really want a hard target Reanimator, it's not difficult to do so. Is that your worry, Eli? Are we going to be a majority of his youths again? Well, there's no, like, there's no team thing or coverage of this event, so I don't think it really matters. Just all the combo decks. Alright, that's sort of valid, actually. Alright, what I'm going to do is sort of try to fix that. Alright. I think we can actually fix this. Kirby Swim Unlock? Maybe. Is someone ever even good anymore? Alright, chat, I'm going to cut the second Sylvan Library, because I don't want to draw a second. 
going to move a second carpet to the main. And then I'm going to add like another fluster or an endurance. I think like Eli's point is actually kind of valid. So I'm going to try to fix it like a little bit, you know. So that, that's a shout out to you, Eli, for making me fix it. Whoops. Move. I put it. <laughs> you know, if you call yourself smart and handsome, I don't know what that makes you. Isn't there like a Greek word for that? Only, only you know if there's a Greek word for that. You're too overconfident. Hmm. This smells sus. This is super sus. You're tall and handsome. Is there a Greek word for that? Probably. Ask uh, Galenwaki1. All you, all you gotta do is uh, ask Galenwaki1 about that. <laughs> We are be going to stare at a pool for a few hours. <laughs> the word for when you call yourself smart and handsome is dysphoric. Hard drop cat. Oh. I see. Alright. Um, yeah, we're going to try this. I'm gonna get the deck list up on to CBL for y'all. I'm having a good time vibing with y'all today, though. I actually um, did not sleep very well last night, funnily enough. What the hell? Y'all? Right. Uh, but that's my own fault. Alright, have a good one as well, Hog Hog. Kalos Kagathos upstanding. I see. I don't know that. Also, I will be on tomorrow early in the morning. I might play the prelim. I'm not playing the prelim today though. Just uh not doing it today. Right, we got the cards in. Someone tell me if the deck list is updated. I think it is. Yo, what's up, Lawrence? How you been? Alright. Gonna run a prediction for this league. I think you have 15 minutes to gamble. On it. Are we playing cause return? Uh, I, for now, I have copied Caleb's list, but I assume the reason to play cause return is that it's easy to cast versus Moon Stompy, and it's also just generally easy to cast. Yeah, I think it's 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 mostly for that reason. I haven't played Legacy in a while, but we're gonna we're gonna just jump into it. Easy drinking board wipe on a crisp fall afternoon. It is really nice here. It's like 74 degrees outside, but there's like the humidity is like reasonable. I'm drinking some ginger beer. It's delicious.
It was 70 today? Nice. Yeah, ginger beer is great, especially when you make a... was it? A, not a dark and stormy, right? A mule. Moscow mules. Any riff on a mule is, like, great. Mules are poggers. They are. They are indeed poggers. To cover the... Someone called the dog Planeswalker statistics dog and I laughed. Also, chat, uh, if you want to support the stream, hit that follow button. That's free to do. If you really want to support the stream, consider using a sub here. Twitch Prime sub is free. Regular subs are discounted this month. So thanks for being here. God. My hand's like really, really not very good. Alright, this hand's fine. Question is what to bottom? I know this is what I signed up for. Thanks, Lawrence. I actually cut the second Sylvan Library. Lawrence, how do you feel about that? I'm actually going to draw the Endurance this turn in case they're Reanimator. And if they're not Reanimator, re like if they're a blue deck, I can just brainstorm into the other cards. I care if they daze this? Probably not. So this can get Taiga. I'm gonna bottom this probably. Probably the ending. Yes. It's kind of like weird. Okay, uh, I guess they might not be a blue deck if they just snap with that resolve. If they're like elves, this is kind of problematic. Sylvan Library is one of your favorite cards? Interesting. I didn't know that. Bad place for this to be. Is it blue green omni? Fuck. It's blue green omni for sure. This is not the matchup I want for this deck. Oh, maybe it's not. Well, I also don't want that to have to have happen to me, but whatever. They're just like a bant deck. I brainstorm last turn. Unknown. I don't want to play out this Sanctuary. I think I can get better value out of it later. Playing it out means I just have- I lose access to it for the entire game.
Loam Library Thirst for Knowledge. Okay. Sub Dabo Double Zero. Oh, so it says a four seam mirror, but they have to carry. Well, time to pay eight. Okay, maybe not time to pay eight, but time to pay four, probably. up the boat guy hope you're having a good one oh, I don't want to do this I think I actually should have paid it but too late now yeah like I could have gotten one card deeper You sold your magic collection? Did you want to? Your 90s MTG, thanks for the raid. Hope you're having a good one. Yep, this was fairly likely, but nothing I can do about it because of Teferi. I also need to play a little bit faster. V indeed. Got it. I can just have six because of Teferi. God dang Teferi. Wait, right, thanks everyone coming from the 90s MTG channel. Hope you're all having a good one. If you're new to the stream, hit that follow button and help support the stream. Mr. Dr. Prof. Patrick. Interesting name. Oh, this is... okay. I see what's going on. We're getting Harland. Fascinating. What's in their hand? They have a Jite.
Ooh. Yeah, carpet is insane. I'm going to leave this back because of culture complete off of carpet. I mean, if we got forced there, what am I going to do about it? I think it's just correct to play all my things, right? Just use all my mana. Carpet is a better magic card than those other cards, yeah. Look at, look at Minx and Boo. Such good pals. I mean, Carpet is one of the best cards versus Is It, honestly. Like, this card is so obscene. my sylvan yes please chat let's go chat Alright, now they can't beat me with Holger anyways, so... I know they have one GTA in hand. Boom. Got game one. Yeah, Carpet plus Library definitely decided that game. Do I think they're going to have Caracas in their deck? Because the primary reason to play Wasteland in this deck is for Caracas. I guess it doesn't harm me too much to just leave it, right? I think, personally, I kind of want to just cut two Prismatic Endings. Is that crazy? Because it's kind of just a... it's really expensive. How crazy is it to cut two endings, chat? A little bit. Yeah, I guess so. Oh, well, you... I think you can't cut Loam, actually, which is... I guess that sounds kind of bizarre, but I don't think you can. I 
could see not having all of the Hydros. Maybe I only need, like, two Hydro, two ending. Is that crazy? Alright, we'll try that instead. There's not actually a lot else you can cut. You could, like... You can't cut Caracas, because Caracas is actually insane. I don't think you want to cut Narset. Maybe I'm actually supposed to cut Narset on the draw. But it seems like I probably shouldn't cut it, you know? Uh, I don't think Snapcaster has aged well, so I'm kind of well on that, personally. Darkling Culture complete as well. Counterspell is so awful nowadays, I think. Like, I don't think there's actually any matchup where I'd want Counterspell. Which is kind of funny. Well, I guess it's not that kind of funny. Like... What's the right word for it? One of Sylvan Library coming in clutch. Okay. Fine, I guess. I was kind of afraid it was going to be, um... Whatchamacallit? What does that mean, Lawrence? I don't know what that means. What I should actually do is just play Narset or check them. If they have it, so be it. It's fine. I think I'm kind of just priced into getting Pyroblast, actually. 
Yeah, I, I do not see any reason to down tick. I mean, obviously it's better versus blast, but whatever. I do like how Iteration is getting around this Norse set. Oh my god, they have actual Savens? Oh my god, this is a disaster. How many fucking Teferis do they have? Oh, that's why I didn't blast the Narset. Wait, did I leave in all my endurances? Or did I cut? This is straight up Jund I mean, the Almouth deck in Modern is basically a Jund deck too. It's just like the best Jund deck you've ever seen in your life.
You got your Bob signed by Bob Mauer? Cool. Do I even care? I have Caracas manage it. I signed Gitaxian Pro? I don't even remember that. I know I said we'll die, but I think that's fine. I had forgotten that, I'm not gonna lie. It's been a while. I mean, I could have used a Hydra at some point. Maybe I was supposed to counter it, but I thought I could, like, wait for a better spot. I don't know. I think they need the fifth land for the Savines Reclamation, is really what's going on here. It was exact. yeah, exactly Uro punished me. So I really, like, I think these... This man is like kind of screwing them, honestly.
I don't know what they were trying to do either, really. I'm reading the chat now. Also, this Karakis basically soloed my opponent. Karakis is so important in these mirrors because it manages this. It manages Mixin Boo as well as Uro. So it's like, it's it's actually like, this is the reason people play Wasteland, to be fair. Petrol's left, actually. Moat Inventor? That's probably not gonna happen, to be fair. Anyways, I forgot how long every match takes with this sort of deck. They can't even attack me, I'll just fucking block with my arrow. Moden Minx? That sounds kinda hot, actually. Does it matter what I do? Probably not. I don't want to tap this Karakas because it keeps my Uro safe from all their shenanigans. Vegetables. Oh, that's the last one. Now I'm out of vegetables. Are you tired of this yet? I'm kind of tired of this already. Just trapped Mirren and said no. That sounds even worse, honestly. <laughs> oh, we're way past five minutes of garbage time so far. I'm not even sure why my opponent's still here. To Fair. Last I even have left. No. Oops. card is bugged in Mirrodin. 
right now. Scythe of the Wretched? That's one of the first rares I opened from Mirrodin. Which is kind of funny to think about, I guess. I should have shuffled. Well. I just got a phone call. It said scam likely. Thank you, iPhone. I think it's garbage time now. I did tell my Caracas, but I think that's going to be okay. Are we calling you out of playing your deck? Yo, what's up, Eggy? Long time no see. Hope you're having a good one. It's your cousin? Is your, is your cousin Marvin? He's got to check out those tunes. Maybe. I still have one more Norse set left on my, or one more Endurance left on my deck, right? So if I don't, this could be problematic. I don't know.
Pull from eternity? What about Ilks of Immortality? Uh, Accord for five, I was just trying to play fast. Is that to answer? Look, I was just trying to play fast. Do you know how, like... Also, like, when that happens, I actually just start ignoring the chat because I don't want to time out, if that makes sense. Also, I think I actually need a few minutes rest uh, after that one. Alright, I'm going to um, actually run a quick ad and take a three minute break before the next match because I those are so exhausting. Again, thanks for everyone being here. We're playing four color hamster Caleb deck, and I'll be here back in three minutes. Uh, stick around. Yo, what's up, Stu, right? It's been a while. How you doing? And yeah, I mean... The 4C Omnath mirrors are the same way in Modern, except Traverse for Emrakul actually ends the game. Nowadays. Like, when someone gets mind slavered essentially for like 8 mana, the game actually tends to end a lot faster. Matt, I enjoyed Oko and Legacy until the first time I played a game where both players had one, then I stopped playing it until it was bad. Oh, hey, chat, thanks for, for everyone being here. If you want to support the stream, hit that follow button that's free to do. If you have Amazon Prime, you have Twitch Prime. 
Use it somewhere. Use it here. Everything's appreciated. We open chests for that. Uh, also, it is sub tumber. And uh, if you want to sub, it's a good time to do so. 20 to 30% off. You know what they say. Wake me up when September ends. September ends. Just saying. I play Ryan Six Rug Delver the weekend Eldrine came out. Nefet, I would totally go karaoke with you in Vancouver or wherever. What's up, Spider Space? Yeah, for some reason it took Ryan and Six. No, I wasn't playing. Dave played Dredge instead. We concluded that Dredge beat Rogue, actually. Generally speaking. Yeah. Well, I lost to Steve in Standard, so... so this is probably not great but you don't know for sure yeah steve and i are playing on saturday this might be like absolute dog shit but you know it could be a blue red deck there's only two main deck carpets actually all right i probably regret this oh i see okay I wish I hadn't played this out now, but, you know, that's fine. Right. Also, the worst thing about this is it's actually going to keep re-triggering forever. Save munitions expert. This is game one. The record should be shown on the screen as well.
I've tried making it bigger, but it gets like out of focus and weird. I don't have terminus in my deck, so. Matron. There are a lot of things happening here. I need to just right click. Always now. That's an easy shuffle. Trainer Maker. Oh, it's fine.
It's just probably ignoble as well. It might be like some green artifact destruction card. Could be like Mask Vandal, yeah. I think they have to block with enough stuff that this becomes actively good to do. Well, these K returns on my side would look really good. What's up, Mark J? Hope you're having a good one. We have back at 20. Now at 19. Uro is an obscene magic card. I can take the bad cards out of my deck. Uh, I mean, I think we could beat a flip, but I also don't want to risk it. I do want dress time. I'm trying to figure out what to cut. Rooting against me more and more, fair enough. I like endurance because it like it makes it hard for them to attack, but maybe not. I think that's crazy. That was a big part of you not playing Legacy. That's reasonable, you know. I copied Caleb's list, Wonder Pro. What do you want from me? Sort of copied. I made a few changes. I'm not convinced the changes are even good. Alright, I guess I'll not have the lesson. Um... No, I think I can do without the loam. You're right. I think I need to cut, like, one air card. I think maybe I can just shave on Minx, actually. Well, I'm not going to defend it because I don't know the answer.
Yeah, Lawrence, I actually brought that up when someone questioned the three ponder. I'm just like, there's already a million air cards in the deck. So it kind of doesn't matter, you know? Where's Engineered Plague Splash? Not necessary. Only bust out Seismic Assault. Probably not for a while, honestly. Casting opposition agent? I guess they are. Why didn't you just cavern rogue? You're gonna do that. Come on, Eli. Yeah, come on, Eli. What was actually going on is I wanted to save Plow for a Goblin Lackey, Eli. Because if I suppose I, I Plow the Opposition agent, agent, they play Lackey, it ends up really poorly for me, I think. Yeah, exactly. That's that was my reasoning as well. Oh, I need a brainstorm badly. Have to let it go, unfortunately. Yes, if I had a second Mystic Sanctuary here, it would be a lot better, but it's also because I drew the Mystic Sanctuary, otherwise, it would be almost identical, you know? Oh, Magic Mics, thank you for the raid.
Alright, I'm gonna turn on my light real quick. Good. Question is, how do I do this? I need another plow. Now I'm looking for Uro K okay, return. Did I leave him the loam? I don't remember. Oh, damage. That's nine. They probably have a blast based on how this game's been playing out. I think I have to force it, which kind of sucks. I'm pretty sure they have a blast based on... Oh, they don't? Okay, that's... Alright, sure. That was unexpected. Pokemons. So this is one, two, three, four, five. I have to plow that.
No, dress down would have actually shut off the thing, so maybe I should have dressed down, actually. It cuts off the haste. Alright, I need Uro. God. Yes, I care about Violet because they have Swing Gang. It was that one, but like... No, you didn't blank out, but I thought I was going to just use it uh, anyways. Alright, we're 2-0. Oh, Caracas throw for one more trigger? Maybe, I don't know. I have just one in play. That was a close one, I guess. I, w I almost died. But Uro is a really, really messed up re like, it's a really messed up stabilization mechanism. I also think they can't beat Uro on point. They like have to blast it and have graveyard hate right away. Otherwise it just doesn't work. I also think I navigated that game fine. Did Caleb Trophy? I don't know. I just copied it from his list. Or I like I made a few slight changes based on how I want to play the deck. But the K return was obviously backbreaking, you know? So what this Sting Scourger is for forehead. Uh I don't think Sting Scourging Uro is gonna win very often there. Alright, I I need to use the restroom real quick. I'll be right back from match number three. Thanks for everyone being here. We're apparently up to 400 viewers. All right, I'm back. Thanks for everyone being here. I'm gonna play the third match. If you want to support the stream, hit that follow button. That's free to do and help support the stream. If you really want to support the stream, consider using a Twitch Prime sub here. It's also September, so it's 20 to 30 percent off, and it helps support the stream. A sample handle, right? I guess I'm supposed to keep. I don't know, is it 8 cast? My hand's not very good versus 8 cast, I think. Those appear to be 8 cast. It does, Lawrence. It does. Right. 
The carpet is not good here either. What are we gonna lose? Did I add a meltdown? I think I did actually add a meltdown. Ooh. We're cooking, chat. We're cooking. Or I'm dead. Take your pick. What does Slimmy my Jimmies mean? Never mind, I don't want to know. I could try casting those. I don't think it would do very much. <laughs> I mean, that's that's what I'm gonna say personally. Uh, I like on as well, and dress down is fine as well. I think I actually want to cut two minks, as funny as that sounds. Because I just, like, I don't know, it, it's so hard for it to be good enough otherwise. I don't know. That game was just kind of a, that was a beating. I got destroyed, you know. I guess. I'm not like the most thrilled about this, but I'm not gonna mulligan either. I've seen that, so I got 100% of the time. Oh, I mean. Alright, chat. We have a plan. It's just to protect my meltdown and win the game with it. It's like kind of okay, actually. Weirdly, Let's see what they do this turn, I suppose. Okay, that's pretty good. Do I melt down this turn for zero? Or I think I just wait, actually.
Make them do something. Cool. I will select Force of Will. Uh, I should've just pyroed. Why didn't I pyro? Whoops. I just blanked right there. Don't ask me what I was doing. Okay, now they know about Meltdown. Oh, it's getting, it's getting stormy out there. Uh, yeah, no, I fucked up. I was thinking I wanted to use this for Mystic Sanctuary, but I don't think that actually matters very much. Home's pretty good here, though. I just want lands now, because I have so much gas. I don't think it's going to matter, but it was also wrong, if that makes sense. having your ancient thing. Doesn't do shit. Were they trying to sacrifice their lantern, but it requires to tap? Yeah, but it's, it's tap sack, that's why... I... Yep. Alright, game three. Warping whale? That would be funny, I guess. Would be funny if we got Warping Weld. <laughs> Yo, Pache! Pache has a good point. This is probably the first time Mishra's Bubble has ever been Meltdowned. Yeah, you hit the Meltdown. You can Warping Weld the melt Meltdown. Do I want Fluster? Probably not. Doesn't do very much. I think I just submit and hope it goes okay. Yeah. I think you're priced into keeping this once you sign up to play this deck as well, but it's not great here. This is looking better. Waste, though? Waste would have been really, really good there. This way. Alright, well... They're going to perhaps get Pithing Needle, so I should fetch twice. But I guess I don't want them killing my land either, so I think I probably should just fetch all three times, right? Yeah, no, we us having time to develop is very helpful here. Obviously. I wanna see what they get before I do anything. Dress Down does the same thing in Modern versus the Saga. Like we we're basically doing what happens in Modern, you know? 
Actually, I wonder if I should have... Okay, so they did get Pipping Needle. I wonder what they're going to Needle. I only have one Wasteland. Because <laughs> they don't know that. But also Waste looks like it would be good here. So, good beats, right? Can trip double terminate. How does it taste? Hmm. Okay. How it tastes, I suppose. Well, oh, that's a good one. Okay, chat. Those all look pretty good to me. Actually, I should have left the, uh, I should have put the Sanctuary back, I think, actually. That was a mistake. I don't know if it'll matter. Probably won't. But, I always could. Yeah, the anti-artifact cards and Legacy are just different power level. See, wait, Meltdown is over 20 years old at this point? Yikes. Oh my god, it is. Holy crap. <sighs> Can't believe it's 20 years old by this point. You got my loom. Remember when I didn't put the Sanctuary back in my deck? Costing me now. Am I covered? I don't remember. Alright, chat. So demoralizing? Yeah, it is. Bosejud Boil was more annoying for than Choke for certain decks, is what I would say. Just an arrow away from the game ending, but that's pretty good too. So can't do that. Can do this.
incineration. Don't even bother casting it this turn. I don't have a red source off of that anymore. Here. Probably, yeah. Actually, I don't think I do. I think I'll just plow it. I found two of my three arrows there. That's fine. Just looking for lands. So, because the arrows are on the bottom of the deck, I'm supposed to take this turn and I think shuffle. Really matter what I get. I guess. Sure. We're in garbage time. Initiative is like Monarch, but Wordier and more obnoxious. That's probably true, actually. Monarch plus dungeon. This card does not matter. We're just waiting to find Uro, I think. I guess I use it, otherwise I'll probably discard. It's fine. I mean, I can't really imagine losing from this board state. Because all of their draw twos are shut off, which is one of the ways they, they can get out of this. My hand's also just a million pyroblasts. My last red source is a taiga, though. So I guess that's, like, somewhat problematic. Reveal hand button? Yeah, maybe. I'm trying to get more permanence out of the meltdown. Can I just melt down for six? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, I'll just melt down for six, I guess. Kind of a dangerous game I'm playing, I guess, but. It's not that dangerous. Okay. I guess that might matter. Probably won't though.
song's a banger, though. It's almost dead somehow. That should do it. What's up, Mark Dash? Why are you in the UK? Did you move? Or are you on vacation? It was really late for the UK. Business trip? Cool. Hope you're having a good one. appeared to be 3-0. I haven't had a league feel this easy in a long time. Uh, but I'm really exhausted already. I also didn't sleep great last night, but I stayed up late, so that was that was my own fault. Also, it's really, really windy outside, but it's not like it's not actually storming, I think. I think it's just, it's 67 degrees outside and I can hear the wind and it's super nice. My window's open. Five hours and five hours, the Euro method. I would 100% believe that Depths Leagues are a lot faster than this. Oh, uh, Mixed and Boo is a really good card. I played it in Cube, and I'm just like, holy, holy cow, this card is just unbelievable. Still dies to bolt. Dying it dying to bolt, I don't think is a deal breaker, honestly. I think I think it being four mana versus is a delver is more of a deal breaker, but Eli, why did you do that to yourself? It sounds like something you don't want to do. So chat, thanks for everyone being here. If you want to support the stream, hit that follow button. That's free to do. Consider using your Twitch Prime sub here. That's also free and takes money out of Bezos' pocket. And it's also Subtumber. So if you want to partici participate before September ends, consider subbing. It's 20 to 30% off. Also, wake me up when September ends. Also, if you don't want me to sing that, you could also sub. <laughs> it's 
Spider's Face, you don't like it? <laughs> oh, Spider's Face doesn't like my singing. I think I'm gonna go cry myself to sleep. September karaoke one. Um, I don't know. I like him to Torak as a card, actually, but it's also not a very good card anymore, thankfully. HK doesn't want to be around either. Wait. Hold on. Do people who here doesn't like Jarvis karaoke? And if you don't like Jarvis karaoke, why are you even here? You have to ask yourself that sometimes. <laughs> Jarvis okay. Fair enough. Jarva okay, huh? Christ, I don't know why I'm so exa exhausted. Take the Jarvis, leave the karaoke. Wow, Louie. Apparently no one appreciates the Jarva Jarva Oki. Oh, I'm playing against Luxac. Am I going to get luxac out, chat? Or chat, type 1 if I'm going to get luxac out, and type 2 if I'm, if I'm not. I should have made this a pull, shouldn't I? Oh my god. Okay, good, it's only goblins. This is actually probably more... No. The boost horses are more critical, so I'll just plow the lackey. Expect outcome is in fact 1.5. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna get up back out. My hand's actually really good versus goblins. It's kind of funny to think about. Oh, this was the punish, but that's okay. I guess I'll just deal, probably. Eli, I'm sorry. Also, I'll send you a message. Actually, incredibly white. Look. Is this what it's like to be on a rock? Chad, is this what it's like to be on a rock? What is going on? The deck is cooperating 100%. Hmm. I didn't move. I'm still in the same house, Mark Dash. If I die in the mud. Should I tell my opponent that they can always mulligan? Or that they can always concede at any point? I'm not going to, but I was thinking about it. Wait, I'm at 61 cards. Oh, Norset's don't are unnecessary. 
Yeah, talking to people never helps, I agree. Uh, I'll actually have the Endurance in over Minx. Hands also really broken. All right, well, my opponent can see the match. I don't remember. I guess they were really just off it. I don't know. That was a much faster match. All right, we're playing for the trophy. Yeah, I agree. That game two hands also unbeatable. I mean, I just like, both of his hands were kind of nuts. My opponent mulliganed to five and conceded. No, it was goblins. Uh, you need to type the ampersand. Uh, depends on who you ask. I think goblins is like... Hmm. I think most people would not consider goblins to be one of the five best decks in Legacy. Is, is the best way of putting it. But I think there's actually some hope for it with the Horde Master, but... Not if you put Ignoble Hierarch in, in your Horde Master deck, I think. I don't think Hydro Blast kills goblins. That's an unpopular take, is it? Is it actually an unpopular take? Yeah, I don't think a one for one counter spell versus goblins is like a deal breaker. Yeah, exactly what Virgo said. Also, Virgo, how you been? I haven't seen you in like literal years, I think, right? You only consider travels. I wanna play your and drop to go to school. Cool. I think there usually is it, and this hand's actually pretty good versus it. You just have to draw some gas, obviously, but. It's elves. Okay, I have regrets. It's elves, I guess. Well, this hand is extremely bad versus elves. I hope I draw a brainstorm. It was close! Alright, I'm getting on a rock now. Chad, what are my chances of winning now? Buying high end dopamine to heal a hand? Is dopamine an illegal Schedule 2 drug?
Wow, Wacky, you said this is hilarious? I thought we were friends. Point oh one percent, How dead am I? It looks like a thousand percent dead. Yeah, you you better play around the stuff I have. I don't have any stuff. Fine, Gersh. How does this make you feel? Uh, my opponent's definitely not a he, so it's not, not, say that. I actually don't know what my opponent's pronouns are, so... It's like kind of hard. Engineered plague. Cosmex return is basically engineered plague, sort of. I prefer the term villain, to be fair. Because, you know, I'm the hero in my own story, and everyone else is the villain, you know? Am I allowed to keep this? No, Fluster's, like, Fluster's pretty bad, because they also have, uh, whatchamacallit, Shepard. Am I supposed to keep this? Actually, I should have bought in the Savannah, because I, I would rather just get all blue. Great. This is not good. Yes, I do this. This is really not very appealing, but it is what also what's going to happen. I wish I hadn't drawn so many minks and booze. It's like a little bit excessive. That really doesn't like me right now.
Maybe I just have to take Brainstorm and Brainstorm for multiple removal spells. Yeah, I think I have to. Because I don't think I can just win by one for one and getting the Norse I killed. I think it just doesn't work. Well, the real issue is, I think if I were them, I would just play around a sweeper by getting Gaia's Cradle by activating Reclaimer. Oh, well, actually. Five, six, seven. Oh, that's not lethal, I guess. They have another green creature that's probably lethal. People love math. I'm glad to hear it. So they're reclaiming for Dryad Arbor and knowing her hoof that lethal. Okay, well I guess we can't know for hoof anymore. I mean my Narset's dead I guess, but... something. I think I'm supposed to cast it now. The brainstorm first? Oh boy. Great. So they can pick up their shepherd, but it still kills Symbiote and Arbor. Feels like I'm gonna lose still though, unfortunately. I should just shuffle and look for more removal. Oh, mix and kill boo. Uh, I should have considered that. You're right. I'm gonna just shuffle this, I think. Good. 
Swords is okay. At least. Maybe I should have taken the Uro. I thought he just needed a removal spell that turn to try to deny them mana, but maybe that's the wrong way of thinking of it. I want this Narset. I think so, actually, yeah. I should have attacked. Oh no, they have Dryad Arbor. Of course not. It's actually what's up there. This game's sort of working out okay, it looks like. Robinson danger. I need to find Arrow. But it has to be wait, that does that even do it? Uh fuck. I don't oh we have dress down in my deck, right? So I have to draw dress down plus plow, I guess? Yeah, that has to be it. Thank you, Primetime. Appreciate the words. Okay, that does it, I think. All right, so. I forgot to activate this. I should have also done it in my end step. No, I, fu I fucked it up. Yep, you're right. Uh, I was just so excited that I hit my out, but I think it's going to be fine still. You're right, Lutz, of course. This should have been a 4 4 versus their 3 4. But I, this is kind of why I think this plan's not very good anymore, honestly. Because it no longer has trample or haste. That's why. Oh, it says up to? I see. Okay. I'm learning. I was just slightly distracted because I was so excited, you know? That's not a real excuse, by the way.
Wonder what my opponent's thinking about, though. Yeah, they need a Shepherd plus a bit cards, but one of the Shepherds is gone. Alright, so they're bogging me, I guess. Alright, yeah, that's fine. has left the game. Alright, game three on the draw. Do I change much? Probably not. This is why I don't really like Fluster or like any of these because of Alice Shepherd. I guess they didn't have any good lands left to get, but who can say for sure? Seemed like they were mostly dead. By the way, if if they sandbag Poseidon you for dress down in response to plow, it's kind of brutal actually. But let's hope that doesn't happen. Also, I think I just have to keep this and just hope this cantrips into removal spells. But you know. Shepherd's back. Yeah, I've Poseidon dress downs in modern before for some more reasons. I don't like where this game is going for my health. I think I just need to find a pile. Alright, I guess I kill. Maybe I just. I can put two lands back for sure. The question is, what do I kill? It's Reclaimer or Mystic, really. But I think it's Reclaimer, yeah. Well, it's more mana the turn after, Stu.
Yeah, I hope they don't have a Cradle. Cradle's obviously pretty bad for me, but we'll see what happens. Whoa. I guess they're gonna be Symbiote? Or Visionary? It's... There. Chat! Oh my god! What? What is that? Can we get some hype in chat for that top deck? What? What? <laughs> What was that? What was that top deck? Or it says, I literally hate everything that's happened this week. Why would you say that you hate everything that's happened this week? Alright, um... I do this. That was really ridiculous. Like, Dress Down was a ridiculous card this game. Right. Both streamed Pride Hard, did they? And then for two. Sure. Oh, another King Arson. It's only a 7-7. Seven, seven. Big waste. So I need to get Savannah, I guess. I guess I could also get the other thing. Green Ranger. Turn. Yeah, 
Yeah, baby! Easy trophy! Look at that whitelisted four color control look. Oh my god. Am I. Am I hat. Uh, oh my god. Do I have to play this on Sunday? Took 84 years. More of the hamsters? Thank you for the Twitch Prime sub. Let's open a chest for that. I don't play that many leagues, Prime Time. What the fuck is this? Old rut scene? Could have been won by clicking cards at random. Freebie Rage Scoop round four. That that round I was just whitelisted as well, yeah. Because I just literally drew K return off the top. Is Innistrad still new? No. <laughs> You're not this card gate off the screen. Alright, alright. We're off. Oh, I'm very tired now, though. I was already tired, but playing that... Playing those matches made me extremely tired. Uh, no, it's not even that prime time. It's just. Hmm, what's the best way of putting it? Retired to. Raw, Raw, Rustine, Lover of the Russian Queen. Oh my god. We did dodge the League Nonsense of Infinite Reanimator, which is nice. I don't think the L's matchup is great for this deck, though. I think I definitely ran super hot. But I will let Caleb know that I've won all the matches really easily with his deck. Alright, chat. Um... <laughs> yeah, that's right. I could have bought someone off and you don't know it. It was a 5-0. The deck felt pretty good. The mana felt great. Caleb is just a genius. Uh, Wonder Pro. I played a lot with Dress Down, so I'm not gonna miss that shit. Bought Shuffle off on the K return turn? I did, yeah. Yeah, I, I mean, I just have massive respect for Caleb. Um, alright. But yeah, 5 0 Deck feels great. I, I mean, I made a few changes. I'm not sure the changes. Oh, I guess I drew. The meltdown I added was actually relevant, right? versus uh, 8 cast, so I guess that change actually did matter. Instead of having the 5th blast, Meltdown killed my 8 cast opponent, right? So I guess that change mattered actually quite a bit. Yeah, I don't know. Um, anyways, that's 4 color hamster. I think I'm going to... let's see, what am I going to do? Well... I, I usually do kill a red that. It's true. 